Don't look, Marie! You have to see this! It's not just a toy castle. There's a whole world inside called Spieland! Put the doll here to enter! Broken dolls feel pain too, and seek a safe place to take shelter. But don't ever tell anyone. Every Christmas, when I was a child, I visited my godfather, Drosselmeyer. During those visits, I became good friends with his apprentice, Fritz. We fixed toys together and gathered them in a toy castle called Spielland. We even imagined that we lived with the dolls in their world. Many Christmases have passed since then, but I finally got a chance to visit again this year. I can't wait to see them. Our toy castle! I can't believe it's still here. Oh no! A mouse got into the workshop! Another mouse! This place is overrun with them! My poor toys! Who's that? Marie? Old Drossmeyer's eyes aren't what they used to be. Have you come to see Fritz? Oh dear, Fritz disappeared two weeks ago. That last evening I saw him here in the workshop, working late. The next morning he was gone. Only scattered instruments remained. He's in trouble, I can feel it. But I haven't a clue where he's gone. The only thing I found was his toy castle. Did you find something, dear? We were inseparable. My godfather even joked that we were made for each other. We dreamed of becoming true artisans like my godfather Drosselmeyer. He would give us broken toys to practice repairs. 
He said that every toy had thoughts and feelings, even a soul. When we fixed a toy, we took it to our secret place inside the toy castle, then hid the key in the wall stash. Fritz has gone into Spielland. A world of living toys. I don't believe it. That was just a story he liked to tell. So we need to replace the doll, huh? Well, this is a doll workshop after all. We can fix or build any toy. Why don't you give it a go? Here are my tools. Relax, it'll be just like riding a bike. Strange. The entrance hasn't opened. I guess I should have known it was. Look! It is real! It looks just like it did when I was little! Godfather? Where are you? He must have stayed at the workshop. Too bad. He would have loved to see his creations come to life. I guess I'll have to find Fritz by myself. Stop right there. If you're a toy, continue through. But if you're human, I'll stop you. The Nutcracker keeps the peace that the toys have earned. So leave now and never return. Humans only bring pain and destruction. Leave Spielen now, or I'll shoot! By the Nutcracker, humans have no place among the toys. They only live to break us! You again? Stop! I created you! Godfather! <sighs> Hey. 
I can't move. I remember making this tin soldier, and now he's hurt me. Thankfully, my protective amulet kept you safe. If these dolls want to kill humans, Fritz must be in trouble. Find him while I fix the amulet. I'll catch up when I can. Humans kill toys! They visited Spielen before. The Nutcrackers stopped them, just like he'll stop you. Digsbury, I'm Fritz's apprentice, Kloss. I used to help him fix the dolls until he went missing. Some dolls came with mice. They took away all my sweets and trapped me in here. Fritz told me a lot about you. He waited for you every Christmas. Oops, <laughs> oh, that was a secret. I uh, shouldn't say more, but maybe if you bring me some sweets... Yummy! All right, get ready. I'm a great storyteller. In a small town, there once lived a toy maker named Drosselmeyer. His toys captivated children and adults alike. Every child dreamed of becoming his apprentice, but he could only choose one, Fritz. He had a shining talent for inventions and a kind heart. Children couldn't pass by Drosselmeyer's workshop, as his dolls looked so lifelike. The other toy makers couldn't compete with him, so they tried to learn his secrets.
actually helped me? Humans never help toys, but you really did. How did you get here? The Nutcracker ordered tin soldiers to guard every entry point. However you got here, I'm glad you were here to help. There's another human in Spielland? If he's alive, he's probably in the Mouse King's castle. Help me to fix my twin sister, and I'll help you to get there. She's inside the greenhouse, but the door is locked. My sister and I suffered from cruelty just as the other toys did, but the other saved us and helped us get to His name was He wanted to fix everyone, but he didn't have enough because he entered our world. was their leader, and they brought us war and But it was a human who was indeed of starting everything. So the toys played with the mice against the true enemy. Now, Spieland is guarded by the t led by the A human wants to help me. My speaker is broken. I almost lost hope, but then you arrived. Perhaps there are more kind humans than we believe. You must be careful. If the guards catch you, they'll put you in the tower. You did it! You really are a good person. I'll never leave my sister again. As I promised, I'll help you get into the castle. Here, take this. Where are you taking me? You... you... Trinkets! How dare you come here? The residents of Spielant will have their revenge. Take the human to the tower. Nobody will break the toys again. Christmas, young lady. What brings you here? Friendship? Maybe even love? Either way, be careful. A human named Fritz was arrested here, and you could be next. If the tin soldiers didn't scare you, my riddle should be easy. Prove that you mean the toys and mice no harm, and I'll let you in. He controls the tin soldiers and protects the dolls in Spearland. 
A magical artifact capable of turning a living creature into a toy? He fixed the toys that children broke and created Spielland to keep them safe. That's right. I believe you. May good luck find you this Christmas.